This is our foundry forage, um, and it's been running for maybe a few years now. I'm just doing some maintenance on it, so I thought I'd show you um, what's inside. Uh, it's pretty simple. Uh, here's just a T, a pipe T, um, with some extensions, and this has a little flange on it. I also have an extra washer here um, that I put on here, and that's what attaches through the bottom of the bowl, which is just a drum, brake drum. Um, it has eight holes drilled around the sides. Uh, this is our airflow, um, so that would screw onto here. And then from the other side, air comes in through this side, comes up, out through the holes here, and then we block this off with some type of aluminum can. Um, and this will just be the ash trap, just in case stuff does fall down. Um, this will catch it, we can unscrew it and dump it out. So we've been using this same um, drum for a while. You can see that there's some cracks that have started to form. Not too worried about it, um, because the way this forge works um, is it sits on the concrete block. So this, this system is here isn't actually holding the weight of the drum. So I think that the cracks aren't a big deal. Um, if they start to get bigger, uh, maybe we can replace this, but for now, it's, I don't think it's this a problem. whole structure is just um, concrete block, and we have this here. It's a little bit loose. It used to be tighter. Um, I don't think it's a problem either because, um, again, this isn't really supporting any weight. Um, it just has to be able to connect up to the bellows, which we're using an old hair dryer for. Um, so I think it's fine if it's both our blanks prepped. We're gonna go ahead and start the forge off with a little bit of wood, um, and then we'll heat it up with coal and throw these uh, blanks in the fire. Goes up to the forge, uh, so we'll go ahead and turn it on. Fire's good and hot, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw in our copper blanks. I think we can start pounding it now. Forge works great, uh, very simple, and gets the job done. Um, we'll have to fire it up again to finish this up, um, but I really like working on it, so there's a lot of cool projects that I can pursue with it.